Hello everyone, today I will show you how you can turn your Arch Linux into a macOS style system with the KDE Plasma environment. First of all, go to system settings, then colors and themes. We are not going to change anything in global themes. For colors, click get new and type MKOS Big Sur dash dark and use it. It already looks better this way. For plasma style, click get new again and type Apple Dark Team. For window decorations, you get the point. Click Get New, search for Apple Mac OS Sequoia. This will help us move the close, maximize and minimize buttons to the left side of the title bar. I don't like to pin on more actions buttons, so I get rid of them and drag the ones I care about to the left. For icons, we will go with MKOS Big Sur icons. As you can see, the icons on the left have changed. For cursors, I like the default breeze cursor. I tried to change it to macOS default one, but didn't like it that much, so I will continue using this. Nothing changes in system sounds, and I disabled them. For splash screen, select none. For the login screen, search for Visor SDDM. Now we will tweak the dock. Right click on the panel and set visibility to auto height. You can set your panel height as you wish, but I use 64. Then for the width, set it to fit contents and get rid of everything except the apps. We will change the application launcher to something better. Then add a new panel by right clicking on the panel again and choosing menu bar. Global menu will come as default on this panel, which we need for the macOS style. For the style of the menu bar, untoggle floating. Then click add or manage widgets. We will get the forked K Apple menu Plasma 6. It is the best drop down menu I have tried. Then we will add the simple things like clock, system tray, and plasma control hub. Don't forget to add a spacer for dividing the menu bar. Set the icon spacing to large. If you don't want some of the icons, you can disable them as you wish. For the application launcher, we will use Launchpad Plasma. You can also use Plasma Control Hub if you don't want all the system trace icons shown all the time. Next, we will change the background. Right click on the desktop and click desktop and wallpaper. Click Get New and Search for Macos Ventura. This is my personal favorite, but you can choose anything you want. As you can see, we messed up the cable menu, so we will fix that. For the launchpad settings, right click on it, click configure, click the icon, then click choose and type launch. If you are not happy with some icons, press the supper key and open the menu editor. You can change every aspect of apps on your computer with ease. As you can see, my Safari is actually a Brave browser. There it is. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you have any other questions, I can help. See you guys in the next one.